How to upload MOV videos to Instagram without any hassle? Let's find out together. Hey everyone, I'm Dom from Wondershare Uniconverter and thanks for tuning in. In this video, I'm going to show you how to convert MOV to an Instagram compatible format so you can share your precious moments with your followers effortlessly. In the end, I'll share some tips to avoid converting in the first place, so stay tuned. Let's dive right in. Now before we jump into the solution, let's quickly discuss why uploading MOV videos directly to Instagram might be a problem. Now Instagram prefers videos in specific formats and MOV, though a high quality format, is not natively supported unless it has the proper attributes. And this is how to set them up. We're going to be using the new Wondershare Uniconverter 15, which is an ultra-fast video audio image converter with over a thousand supported file formats and if you get it now, you'll get 20% off and moreover, if you're an influencer, you can join a campaign and be a brand ambassador and win $400. Links are in the description if you're interested. So once you have downloaded and installed the Uniconverter 15, launch it and right from the homepage, click on the converter and then follow these steps. Import your MOV video into the converter. You can do this by clicking on the Add Files button and selecting the MOV files you'd want to convert. Choose the output format. Now the convenient solution would be choosing MP4 because Instagram loves MP4. Let's admit. Everybody loves MP4. MP4 is like ice cream. Who doesn't love ice cream? You don't? Uh, you're weird. But anyway, for the sake of this video, we're gonna convert our MOV files so they could be uploaded to Instagram. These are the attributes that our final output will need to have. Now, I'm not gonna read all of these out, pause the video, take a screenshot, write them down, whatever you have to do. And to set them up, choose MOV to be your output format and then click on this settings icon here to fine tune the attributes based on the aforementioned list. If you don't wanna mess with these settings, you can, like I mentioned before, just choose the output format to be MP4 and then choose the Instagram preset. Now, optionally, if you need to edit the video, you can trim it, you can apply some cool effects, mess with the audio settings, now, once you're satisfied with your settings, choose an output folder. And we're almost there to click on the start all button, but not just yet, because before you do that, make sure that the high speed conversion mode is turned on for even faster processing speed. Now, thanks to the new updates in the Uniconverter 15, the conversion process is ultra fast on both Windows and Mac devices. And besides the speed, the Uniconverter ensures the quality stays the same. Now, I've been raised to always rather get ahead of the problems before they occur in the first place so I don't have to mess with solving or fixing them. So let me share a few tips on how you can make sure that your Instagram video will be 100% compatible with the platform from the beginning. It might be obvious, but if you record a video within the Instagram application using its Reels Creator tool, the video will be perfectly optimized for the platform. Understandably, this is not always possible, especially if you're uploading something that you didn't shoot. But sticking to those videos where you record as well, if you're filming with your phone, this compatibility issue is also annihilated. Now, in case you're filming with a DSLR or other more pro camera, try to record in MP4 as you'll have the least problems with that format. And if you're exporting your video from your video editor tool, Pay attention to Instagram's video format requirements to make sure that your render will be compatible. And if you have tried your best, but your video is still incompatible with the platform, come back to this video and watch it from the top to learn how to convert an MOV file for Instagram using the Uniconverter 15. But that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope it was helpful. And if it was, leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more videos to come and keep the campaign I shared at the beginning of this video in mind so you don't miss the 20% discount. Thank you for watching. I'm gonna see you in the next video.